press the Windows key and the S key at the same time to get into the Windows search box. Type CMD in the search box and right-click on command prompt to choose Run as Administrator. User Account Control window will pop up. Click on the Yes button to proceed the next step. Let's create a print job. Open a notepad. Type printer. Select file. Scroll down to select print. Click on print. And then you can save the file on the desktop. It is a demonstration purpose only. Once you have created a print job. Let's learn how to delete it. Let's navigate to C colon backslash windows backslash system 32 backslash spool backslash printers. In the printers folder, you will see the print job files. In the command prompt window, Type net stop spooler then press enter. In a few seconds, the command prompt will display the print spooler service was stopped successfully. Navigate to C colon backslash windows backslash system 32 backslash spool backslash printers. In the printers folder. Then select the print job files you want to delete. Or you can use CMD command to delete all print jobs. Type del c backslash system 32 backslash spool backslash printers backslash asterisk space slash q then press enter. I will type these commands in the description of this tutorial video you can simply copy it and paste in your command prompt windows when you are being using it is so easy like that. Remember if you want delete any files in the printers folder you must stop the printer spooler service. It is very important step you must remember. Once a file is being deleted. Now you can type net start spooler. Then press enter. In a few seconds the command prompt will display the printer spooler service was started successfully. Thanks for watching. If you would like to see more, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Leave a thumb up on this video as well as share it to your friends.